In this video I'm going to show a quick setup tip that I've found uh, experimenting with the Icon software as well as the Goblin. Uh, what I've noticed was that in my initial setup I used the Goblin on my workbench which I thought the bench was level. However, the Goblin is not. It actually has a tendency of leaning forward. So when I was setting up my stabilization system and I was setting it to auto balance into a neutral um, hover, I found that I always had a tendency of lurching forward. I experimented with my battery balance as well as canopy balance. And it, basically what I found out was that my Goblin was not set up to be 100% centered when it was on the bench. So here's my setup. I'll do this as quickly as possible not to bore you. Uh, first off, it's connected to the bench as well as to the Icon software through my laptop. My power plug is off, so I am running relatively safe. I do have my blades on, but I have zero power going to uh, the motor right now. So from a level perspective, I have one of these multi-bubble levels. Um, basically, it's a 2-1-1 where the removable section uh, comes in handy. If I place it on the Icon, you will notice that the Icon system is level. So with relationship to the helicopter, I am also level. With the relationship to the motor, you can see that it's slightly leaning um, back, but that's fine because the Icon is my center reference. Uh, that's where all the gyroscopes are located. In order to get that level on the bench, what I've done is simply use some screwdrivers to offset the skids. That sets it into this balance mode. And with my Icon software, I'm able to go in and adjust my servos. Now, my initial settings were zero across the board, and what I found is that I had to go with servo one, which actually relates to this blade in this configuration. This is my servo one, this is servo two, and this is servo three. So in the software, servo one is seven, servo two is 12, and servo three is zero. Now, I maintain servo three is zero for one simple reason. When I was checking my pitch, positive and negative, I found that setting that at zero gave me the best option. Now with everything set to my reference, which is the icon, my blades now, both left and right blade, are tracking perfectly. They are both level with relationship to each other. If I come across at this level, you'll also see that they're both uh, tracking level, nice and clean. There's no issues there. So that was my issue. The um, Goblin had a tendency of leaning forward even though I had it set up correctly, but with a simple bubble level and a little bit of time, I was able to get both blades to track properly. The heli is flying uh, perfectly. Uh, it's one of the best helis that I've had, uh, also one of the most expensive. So a simple bubble level cost me more than about four bucks. Uh, I was able to get this thing up and running perfectly within about 20 minutes. Again, servo one, servo two, Servo 3 in your Icon software, all level with relationship to the actual Icon unit itself. And that's about it. Um, I can go into more detail, but right now uh, I just wanted to give a quick uh, under 4 minute over review of what I had achieved.